Good morning guys, so I'm just chilling out on the sofa because it's been a long morning because Daisy decided that she wanted to get up really early um, so I brought her downstairs so that Louise could have a few extra hours in bed and she just crawled her way over to say hello What are you reading Daisy? Are you reading a little paper? Are you reading a paper? Look at your little feet going This is how this is how advanced she is, guys. She reads. She reads now. Eight months old and she reads. She doesn't really. But yeah, so I brought her downstairs early so that Louise could have some extra hours in bed. So that was that was good. Um, but I'm feeling it now. I'm feeling it. I'm a bit tired. So I'm just having five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, I've had about an hour on here. Um, so Louise is just up in the shower. And then I'm going to be heading out to the gym as well. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to shower. And then we're probably going to go to um, Halfords today just to look at some new car seats because we're going on holiday in about a month's time. Uh, so we want Daisy to have a really big kind of comfortable car seat as well. So we're going to go check that out, see whether we can uh, pick up a good deal today. Um, if we're not, then we'll probably order one. Um, and yeah, and then we're probably just going to come back and have a lazy day. Lazy, lazy days are the best. Lazy Saturdays are the best. Give us a thumbs up if you think that lazy Saturdays are the best. That would be really great. Are you saying hello ah! to everyone? Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hi. Hi. You're not, you're not paying attention today. We probably need to get tidied up as well today, don't we, Days? Are you going for everything? This is why... This is why I shouldn't leave everything on the floor because this girl gets it. So I better go and tidy up. Seriously, I'm just walking around and Daisy is just following me. This is great. Look at her. Look at her go. Are you a little slug? Daisy, are you a little slug? Hey, look at her go, guys. Look at her go. Look at Daisy go. Yeah. It's so much harder now that she can crawl. We literally have to make sure there's nothing on the ground like this. Huh? Can I have this please? Thank you. For her to grab hold of and put in her mouth and things like that. So we gotta be so much more careful, which is great because it makes us uh, tidy up more. Hi, <laughs> How many times, Daisy, have I wore this? <laughs> Do you want mommy to take it off? Oh, mommy's got soggy hair. Mommy's got soggy hair. So Daisy's crying because Louise has come down with her um, towel on her head. But it's happened. I do it all the time. I know. Like Louise literally wears it all the time, and Daisy just took one look at her today and was like, "Ah!" And she's been crying ever since. We just bought a new push chair, so I'm going to take it out of the box. It's the Joy, or Joey, who, however you pronounce it. Beat Nitro I X. Think. 
Got a new push chair. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you can put Papa. Hello. Do you like it? We <laughs> get. Get a bum ba ba, which you love holding and chewing on, and it reclines all the way flat. It's a little, only a little teeny shopping basket. Do you like it? Do you like your new push chair? Yeah. See. So, Hey guys, so we've just come into Halfords now just to uh, see if we can get Daisy a car seat. So we're going to head in now, see what sort of prices we've got, see what sort of deals we can get. And uh, just see if we can get her a bigger car seat ready for our holiday. So that's going to be really cool. So we're going on in. Daisy, are we getting you a car seat? Are we getting you a car seat? So here we go. We think we're going to get this one here. £120. Are you worth it? Are you worth it? £120? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go for this. Look at all these car seats. Oh, yeah. Should we get one as well? You can just grab that. What do you mean? It just clings to the screen, I think. Oh, it's one of them. Oh, there's roller one. Get the roller one. Uh, I don't mind really. Uh, little princess on board. Keep them together. Yeah, I know we looked at them. So I did. It's like a rectangle one. Yeah. What one do you think's better? Well, this is a roller one. We can like roll it back. What do you think? Rolling or...? It's up to you. I'm sure I know, but it's just... Get the rolling one. They're, more, they're like twice the price. Huh? They're twice the price. Oh. Guys, after what seemed like an absolutely it's absolute yeah. eternity, Louise did a very good job. We finally got Daisy in her new we car seat. So. From to fit it we should have just done Why that, shouldn't we? Say no when he asked you. Because I was thinking I was going to fit it, but then you decided to take you over. You wouldn't have had a clue because I've been watching YouTube videos all morning. Blah 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 blah. So Daisy, <gasps> say hello to everyone. Are you in your new car seat? You can see that her face is overjoyed. She's a bit stressed like mummy. Yeah, she's a bit stressed like mummy, so we're gonna go home now. We're gonna go home now. So I've just uh, <coughs> dropped Daisy and Louise off at home um, because I needed to come out and get some um, ingredients for our dinner tonight. I just felt like I wanted just to stick the camera on because, as you know, we've just uh, bought a car seat for Daisy. And this might sound really weird, but we've just bought a little car seat for Daisy. And when she was put in it, she like, seemed like she didn't really like it and she started crying and things like that and she was looking really kind of uh just sad and things uh you know because i and the reason i'm saying this is because i guess it i think it's like a change for her i mean she's used to how her other car seat feels and how she looks within that and she was put into this big big thing that she's not used to and so it's a change for her and that got me pondering as I was driving home, like, you know, change is a really big thing. I just wanted to briefly talk about that. We all go through change throughout our lives, whether that be going through puberty, transitioning into secondary school, or even leaving our parents' home. It's going to be a lot of change. And that's not a bad thing. It's about how you deal with it. And you've got two choices. You can deal with change in a really negative way 
and you can decide, you know what, I'm going to be really angry about this until things get back to how I'm used to, until things get back to normal. Or you can think a little differently and think really positively and really embrace change and think, you know what, change is good. Change is going to give me new opportunities. Change is going to lead me down a direction that I don't know kind of what the end result's going to be, but I'm willing to find out and I'm willing to find some a positive outcome. And that's really important. Change is good. Change teaches us different things. Change is good. Change can be really positive for you guys. It helps you to learn, it helps you to develop, it helps you to see other things in a completely different way. Some things that you used to look at in a certain way, you look at completely differently as you change and develop. So just embrace change, don't be scared of it. You'll be absolutely fine. Hi guys! Hi guys! Do you? She's like, no, mommy, because daddy's filming. Yay! Hi, babe. Yay! Hi, babe. Ready? Yay! She's so sad. When she was little, she used to go in here. And we used to listen to that song over and over and over again. This doesn't need to be in here, does it? No, like it upstairs, no. We saw it in the cupboard out. Yeah. There's a lot of things in there that we don't actually use anymore. Because yeah. Daisy's too small and we just bought a new car seat. But this is staying in here because I'm going to use that for when we go out in other people's cars. Careful, Daisy. She's not can't, she can't sit. Strapped. She's not strapped in, is but she, she can't in? sit up. So how is she going to get oh. out? But oh. she literally takes up the whole space. She used to take up like this much space. We used to put it right at the end. And now she's a big girl! Do you remember that, Daisy? It has little lights, doesn't it? Daisy, how much room that lit, just that little red thing took up? And it used, really, it has a snail and a sun attached to it, but they're in your toy box, aren't they? You look, this will have to go away now until you have a little baby brother or sister. Which will be very soon. No, it won't. Are you having a lot of fun up there, my little friend? Pull it! Pull his hair! Don't do it! Pull his hair! Go away! Hee hee, cutie! Hello! Hi guys! How you doing? How you doing? Louise doesn't feel very well apparently. I do, I'm alright. My back hurts. Oh. My legs are crampy and I've got a headache. Oh dear, oh dear. Well, Daisy's currently in bed and looking cute as always and getting into funny positions. Mm -hmm. And so we're just chilling out now. I'm actually about to make a um, new video for my solo channel. So make sure you head on over there and check that out. And I'll put the link in the description box below. Um, and tonight's shout out goes to Dan Moran. Moran, Moran. Uh, he's been watching our videos for a very long time. His sister actually introduced us to him um, and that was really really cool so Dan thank you for all of your support we look at all of the comments that you leave on our videos and we appreciate them a lot uh, so guys if you did enjoy this video then please do give it a big thumbs up share it with all your friends and leave us a family rate comment in the comment section below and if you're new to our channel then please hit that subscribe button that would be really really great and we'll see you guys tomorrow bye, bye.